Assalamu alaikum everyone. We've got a new video today. Now today's video we're going to show you how to prepare your what we're going to show you, Baba? Our garden bed. How to prepare your garden bed and how to use your garden waste for a fertilizer so you get healthy crops. Yep, is that what we're going to do? We've got a bed here. What we're going to do, we're going to use all our old, old garden waste that we've got in the Dustin over there, and the little compost, it's turned into compost, have a look at that. When you use all that, we're going to put it all into here, so we get a very good crop for, inshallah, for this season, yeah? Last year we had a great crop. So I'm going to show you the other bed, what I'm going to do with them, I'm going to put some chicken manure pellets in them, also add the fish blood and bone, get them all ready, because every year you've got to replenish all the old compost and soil, otherwise there's no, there's no fertilizer in there. If there's no fertilizer, you don't get no good crops, and you got, don't get no good plants, which means no vegetables. Is that right, Baba? No vegetable means we get no food. No food means we starve. Yeah? Okay. Oh, go to the shop. The shop is too expensive in the shops now. See, even little strawberries, six strawberries are like three pounds. See, why buy them when you can grow them? Right, let me show you what we got in the compost bin, all the garden waste. So let's see how it's become. Right, look at that. If we have a look at this. Is there any fries in there? Yep. Um, yeah, let's get, get this. Let's get this. Look. Recently put a watermelon there that rotted. All this, all this was, what was it, Baba? Garden waste. Look at that. See? There's also eggshells. Eggshells, everything in there. Onion skin, apple peel, loads of stuff. Right, so let's show you what we're going to do. To fill it up now here we've got the garden bed what i've done already in the center I've peeled away all the compost as you can see all the old compost look at that so just in the middle make it like a little canal look at the roots of all the vegetables are going to go there so we're going to bury it all up here Right, let's start. Once done, I've filled this one up with a lot of the old compost, garden waste in here. I'm going to fill him up here. You want to do something, Jacob? No. You sure? Come on. Can you help me? No? Okay. So, see this all around the middle. If you can see it, look at that. This is all. Full of fertilizer, quick for the plant. Look at that, lovely jubbly. A bit smelly, you can smell it a little bit. Alright, move it all over. So this bed should be ready, planting a few vegetables in. Hopefully I'm going to plant bottle gourds in this one. Now let's do the other two beds. The other two beds, what I'm going to do, I'm going to add a bit of this and also I'm going to chicken in our pellets, and also fish blood and bone. I'm going to need my drill for the other one. Right. right everyone, so I'm going to get this garden bed ready as well. As you can see, I planted my bottle gourds here last year. So I'm going to do the same this year, plant all the bottle gourds here. What I'm going to do first, I'm going to be using fish, blood and bone and chicken manure pellets. What I'm going to do, I'm going to use my drill and my oro. If 
any of you ain't got one of these, you need one of these. It's a great bit, bit of kit, it's called a Uga. Uga, Uga, whatever, A-U-G-E-R. Get them online. Look at this. Add a bit of this, stick him in our pellet. Hello, Mr. Robin. Come for some food. Come on. Oh. Robins are one of the most friendliest birds in the UK and whenever you dig up your garden you come and look for worms and insects that's probably the reason why Mr Robin is here but where's he gone? where's he buggered off to? right everyone so you saw how I prepared two of my garden beds I've got a few more to do so I'll get, get on with it it's the same process I had a bit of garden waste, six loving bone and then Bit of chicken with no pellets and what I'm going to do I'm going to add a bit more compost on top just a little bit more brand new compost it's the more fertilizer it is the better it is last year I got 77 bottle goods inshallah this year I'm hoping for more who knows but the proof is in the pudding so we'll see how well I do all the best and start Friday I think next week the weather's going to get a bit warmer so hopefully slowly we can start getting all outside now thank you all for watching don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe and assalamualaikum everyone.